It's time. We're going in. We're going in. Forbidden Reach. I've not actually done this zone before, so this is all, all fresh and new to me. I'm going to read some quest text. We're going to get into the story. We're going to see what's going on. Let's have a look. Oh, just a stuck. Oh. Oh, I learned abilities during this. Okay. Awaken Drakthir. Only flashes of memory remain as you shake off what feels like an endless sleep. The Drakthir before you is unresponsive, frozen in place by some unknown magic. You sense that within you lies the power to break your ally free. There may be others within the Kresh who are suspended in this stasis. It is your duty to awaken them. Wait, why is there a... Why is there a less than icon? <laughs> or more than? Good start. Okay, so we start with some green bags. That's exciting. We have some abilities. Do we have a talent tree? No, we don't. Base gear. We don't have a belt for some unknown reason. Or shoulders. Which is even weirder. Oh, I guess to show the transmog. Makes sense, I guess. All right. So we can't... The Drakthir ally is awakened. You are right, son? What? Alpha, what has happened? Who did this to us? Something's very wrong here. We must find our wingmates. Oh shit, there's a map. Our wingmates? Whee. Press jump while falling to glide. I will, just for you. A conjured guardian. Okay. Oh, there's another one here. A quartermaster. I got ya. Yeah, wing mates. Yeah, I love that. Uh, okay. Oh, cool. That's so cool. Like, rocks coming down in that. I love that. Oh, there's a guy. Oh, no. Keithan is not doing well. Not doing well at all. These bones are brittle from uh, the long decay of time. Have they been here for decades, centuries? Impossible to know. A faint hit lingers uh, arcane magic that's held uh, Keithian in stasis. Uh, you feel a pang of loss. He was your friend. Oh. So there's no, like, so it's not like a big time jump then. So we're not like, uh, you know, thousands of years in the past or anything like that. Um... Oh, hello. What about these fellas? Alright, we'll come back to you. Don't worry. Don't even worry about it. <sighs> oh, look, there's some other, uh, some other Drakthir in stasis. So, we got our... Okay, so we literally have two abilities in our... Racials. So it is going to be, uh, very similar to, like, you know, the Death Knight starting zone from back in the day and things like that. Okay, so here's the team. How long were we in stasis? A very long time by the looks of our crash. No talent trees, no. No talent tree yet. Is this still bugged out? Oh, yes it is. Okay. <laughs> uh, alright. Let's... Oh, okay. Sorry, dude. Wake him up. Hello there. My head. Alright. We need to get our bearings. Wait, so the dude just wakes up from stasis and he's like, Yo, yo, let's go. Okay. We get disintegrate. This is your report. My memories are broken as yours, Alpha. Uh, but we're not dwelling on that now. We need to uh, assess and make a plan. We got Disintegrate. Ooh, a staff. That looks nice. Uh, gear up. Hostiles have invaded. Our people have been confined in magic stasis and our crash seems to be collapsing. This is why we train, Alpha. When in doubt, fall back to what you know. First things first. Weapons, armor, supplies. Gather from what you can find and get equipped. While our, I marshal the forces, then we will locate the Earth Warder. Surely Nelfarian can provide the answers we seek. Acquire weapons, armor, and supplies. Oh no, I'm so sorry to hear about Nelfarian, dude. Yeah. Oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> yeah. Not good. There, yeah, they don't know. Yeah, they don't know. 
Those constructs reporting the crash, uh, crash are not animated by the Earthwater's magic. Cannot allow these enemies in midst. In our midst. Destroy and clear a path forward. Alright. Yep. Yep. Neltharian. Not good. Oh, sorry. So we only have three abilities at this point. Which I guess is fine. We have an interrupt as well, actually. They lack critical information. Yeah, they do. Didn't Deathwing use a drag through it uh, when he was corrupted, or did he create the ultimate army? Uh, I guess we'll find out, right? Ooh, a chest! A crystal key! Crystal focus. Okay. What was the point in that? <laughs> what? Oh, serious wand. That was weird. Oh, when obtaining power of the blue magic for 10 minutes. That's like a little buff. Okay. Sounds fine. You know, maybe I'll like the... Um... Oh, it took down the barrier, right. Maybe I'll like the drag theory better after this. I don't really like the... Um... The rotation, honestly, but... Uh, Alright. Oh. Let's get the gear and supplies. So there, this is a pretty massive zone, although we're not technically located anywhere on it. Apart from, like, maybe the bottom, but it doesn't have us on the map. This Wait, is there seven chapters? What? <laughs> what? Seven chapters. Uh, is that all of it? Okay. I love how these are non-hostile. That's so weird. Alright. This constructs for anime with blue dragonfly magic. The Earth Order must have must have never allowed this. Oh well, are we gonna find out? Is it gonna be really upsetting? The gear is ancient, the food has turned to dust. It makes no sense. These rations should have lasted a lifetime. Ooh. Your skills are needed, evo Evoker. The crash is crumbling. And we have few supplies. We must reach the passage out. But we have to get past this arcane barrier. In the chambers beyond, there are Drakthir in need of aid. Uh, tend to their wounds. Destroy any foe who stands in their way. This may uh, be the last time we walk these halls together, Alpha. Make it count. Cutscene? Oh, we actually see it! He found the Earth Warrior. He's in a chamber. Oh. A different dragon. Loyal service of Malagos. Dude. I'm guessing we're gliding down here now, right? I have to heal up our buddies. Wait, how do we heal them? Oh, with Living Flame. Ah, I like that. Okay. Yeah, I mean, this could be... Yeah, that's true, actually. It could be in the past, to be fair, what's going on here. Yeah, just... Yeah, maybe there'll be a time jump at the end. Why would we in the past? Uh, couldn't Malagos be the first to reach the Dragon Isles before the beacon's been lit? Well, isn't Malagos dead? We uh, kind of did away with Malagos. In 2009. <laughs> yeah, 2009. Alright, we're coming out. What's this area called? The Earth Water's Reach. It's like the little hangout crash. Alright. Uh, you healed our people. Well done. Now deal with that dragon. Oh, wow, an upgrade. What? <laughs> Alright, sweet. Cool. It upgraded. A trinket. The blue dragon will uh, collapse our crash and trap us inside. He, uh, he claims to serve Malagos. That name is familiar. But 
Why would any dragon want to keep us prisoner? Listen, Alpha. We were trained to fight besides the dragons, not against them. But we have been left with no choice. Time to do what is done, Evoka. Let's do it. Let's do it. We go a bit faster, but that's okay. Lapis Sago. Yep, pronounce that completely correctly. Was there any Malagos loyalists in the Azure span? I didn't see any. Uh oh. Oh no. Alright, giving it all that. Calm down. Use the flame to heal yourself. I am. Oh wow, I love this. Look. We've been emerged. I recognize this screenshot. We will get that rubble cleared and make no drag theaters left behind, but first we must secure this area. Well, there it is, this first bit. We get oh, we get fire breath. You are an evoker. The best of the best, an elite soldier who has mastered their skills of each of the worms. I expect a lot of you. Your memories may be broke, but the might of the dragon a dragon's courses through your veins. Harness it. One of the most potential weapons in your is your breath attack. The fire within becomes more powerful the longer you inhale. These insects are swarming all over the training ground, so you must make fine targets. Uh, arcane intrusion. The beacon, uh, that beacon ahead, I'm certain it was not there before when we were imprisoned. Spellcraft is not my forte, but I know arcane magic when I see it. The same magic used by the blue dragons in the crash. He said a name. Malagos. That sounds so familiar, but the Earth Order's teachers felt feel distant, fragmented. If this Malagos puts us into stasis, put us into stasis, perhaps the arcane beacon was placed in his orders. Investigate the area and report back. I will. So can I use Visage? Is that a part of this? No. So I literally don't have Visage. And I don't have Soar either. Which is funny, because imagine if you just... <laughs> imagine if you just started soaring. You're like, alright, bye. Oh, did we get Fire Breath? Oh, we did. Oh, apparently you can change the settings for um, Flame Breath, where you can hold it, press it once, and then press it again. Which actually sounds a lot better to me, if I'm completely honest. Oh, cool, look. So it wants me to cast a 2 and a 3 Fire Breath as a part of the quest. So where is this setting? I kind of want to find it. Controls. Oh, there you go. Press and tap. So let's give that a bash. Oh. Yeah, that's so much better. <laughs> that is so much better. There you go. Okay, so you have to hit more than one target. That's a weird... That's a weird requirement for the quest. <laughs> Maybe we should report, report that. That seems a bit odd. All oh, right, you need to put it all the way. Oh, cutscene. Is it a flashback? <gasps> Ooh. Okay, bit of a crazy war. Wouldn't mind a bit of context, but that's okay. I feel like it's meant to be a bit uh, mysterious. Can we use mounts or anything? I guess we don't have mount training, do we? And that would really make sense. <laughs> You're like, yeah, okay, just get in my uh, my night elf, <laughs> my my night elf tiger while I'm in the uh, starting zone where I've never met any other mortal uh, races in my entire life. Uh, so the beacons are placed side the other crushes as well. Our allies are in peril. We must reach them. Alright, we get fire breath now. Although we already had fire breath. Oh. Emberthal. Hello, sir. Ooh, oh. Oh, yes. I'm heartened to see that so many escaped the war crash. My own worm uh, was, not for uh, was not so as fortunate. Um, there were other crushes throughout the reach. Filled with Drakthir and Peril, strong wings will be needed to reach them. Focus, remember your training. Get a feel for the wind again. You must regain your strength and fly to the other crushes. The time is now. Boys, it's time. You received an item. Try again. Restart your sore attempt. This is it. Let us begin your flight training with coasting. 
When you begin to soar, you simply move forward as you are gliding. The difference is you pick up speed as you travel in the same direction. Try coasting through these rings I conjured. Let's go. I'm a pro Sora. I don't need any training. This is actually awesome. <laughs> this is actually really cool. What a cool way to uh, introduce it. Alright, dive through the wings. Oh, oh. Did I miss it? Oh, I missed it. I missed one. No! No! <laughs> no! I got it, I got it, I got it. First time! First time, yeah. Didn't even need to worry about it. Uh, I get they hang this a lot faster than I was. Uh, but then finish the evoker training and specialize in, as a diplomat. Train like we fight. Jumping through hoops is helpful to get your bearings, but we train like we fight, relentlessly. Go ahead and try soaring around the area until you feel that you've mastered technique. Of course, you must keep mindful of the local wildlife and keep an eye out for potential threats. That is why we practice after all. So we're just going to fly around? Oh. Oh, this is- oh, right. There's literally no- no quest here. You can just do it if you want. You don't have to, though. You just got to hand the quest in. Okay. Time runs short. Storm approaches. Your vision from the arcane beacon showed that there are Drakthir trapped within the ar their crushes. They cannot afford to lose any more of our people. The healing wings are the finest medics in our ranks. The crash lies within the caldera of the menders. Leave no one behind, Evoker. Fly with caution. So we're actually going to soar. Let's go, boys. Whoop, whoop. Soaring is so sick, dude. It's like the sickest thing. Look at us go. Like... Now Fairy... Now Fairy would have had our hinds if you saw this mess. No time to waste. Oh, there's a chest. Do we get the chest? I kinda wanna get the chest. Oh, there's two chests. What is it? A bag of enchanted wind. Oh, it's like a buff. Oh, they're just buffs. Where was that item? Do I get to keep it? The try again item? Nope. Well, that's shit. So we have to just... Now what? <laughs> you want to just slowly go down there? Alright, never mind. Check your mount tab. Oh, it's just some... Oh, there you go. Don't mind me, everything here. I'm just gonna run past and get to the quest place in about two hours. We have wounded. Okay, so we're gonna learn our AoE uh, heal now, I guess. Nope. Whatever toxins have infested this crash are potent enough to take down the best healers. That does not bode well for either one of us, Alpha. No matter. Drakthirs are trapped inside. We are going in regardless of the risk. Take a deep breath and follow me. Let's go. Oh. There's no mini map. <coughs> Wait. <laughs> I'm, I'm coughing IRL. <laughs> I still don't really like the, uh, the drag there. Oh, sorry. I didn't really follow you. Cutscene? There must have been a cutscene there. Good. You're awake. We need evoker skills right now. Uh, you recover quickly, Alpha. Good. These escape by crash are healing, but the others remain trapped inside. Rush in and save them. You have to. Uh, we'll have to uh, I will have just have to drag you out again. There are beetle nests scattered around uh, Kuld Kuldura. Their toxic glands will provide a way to counter the effects of that poison. I'm in no shape to collect them. Your cells must rely on your skills. Okay. And... The world, uh, the world surrounding this crash are the home of the... Sil... Scythid? V Voicarious Insectoids. Man, my, my, my reading is so terrible, right? 
Call the numbers. Alright, we're just gonna kill some stuff. <laughs> Alright, the model or the class? I don't mind the model. I'm not, like, I'm fully against the model. I feel like it doesn't look like WoW, but I think that's just because it's new, right? I think once, um, once we, uh, you know, get into, um, you know, the actual game and stuff, it'll probably just be normal. Uh, no, I don't, I don't really like, I'm not much of a, you know, I'm not a massive fan of casters, to be honest, so it doesn't really gel with me, but, yeah. I prefer melee or, uh, hunters, but I guess hunters could be class. I don't know. Either way, I'm not that big a fan, but... I feel like playing this, like learning the spells and stuff, makes it a little bit better, you know? Like makes it easier to get into it. So eventually maybe I'll be like, oh, you know what? It's actually not that bad. Well, there's a quest up here. A cheeky side quest. What's it? What is it? It's from a Tuscar, baby. <laughs> Hold on. All right, Tuscar, what you got for me? The greatest explorer ever. I need help. I... I am, uh, Tono. I was exploring, because that is what <laughs> I'm good at. But I did not realize my sister Ko uh, followed me, and I need you to help me because uh, she is in trouble. So please help, please. Uh, she went into the cave, and she's not good at hiding. Can you find her before the monsters do? I will, Tono. Don't even worry about it. I gotcha. Have you got the uh, ground AoE heal? Not yet. I think that's uh, what you get from the end of this. Hey, we found little Ko! Come with me. Return the children to their parents. That's a cute little side quest, eh? Oh my god, they're on my back. <laughs> I didn't even realize. <laughs> I didn't even realize. I love them and they need to be protected. Well, don't worry, I'm doing it. I want one as a backpack. That'd be fun. Okay. It is the only... Yeah, my only criticism. And it's very... Oh, wait. I don't have any criticism. I have this. The Tuska. Yes, Shalashka? You found my little ones. Vorun Furu. My people would never forget the kindness that you showed my family today. Songs will be sung in your courage. Of your courage. We came to this hour because we saw a great beam of light shining up into the sky. The legends warn us to avoid these shores. But curiosity got the best of us. Curiosity got the best of us. We do not know this place was home to anyone. Though I've never seen your like before, I hope your people and mine be will become friends. May your nets always. There it is, chat. Happy days. Yeah, the Drakthir and the uh, Tuskar are apparently really good friends. Uh, that was something that was in the Azur span as well, which is uh, kind of hilarious, but, you know, whatever. Alright, we got the belt. Silphidor is formidable. Ooh, there it is. Toxicity of the Crash Navy claiming uh, us all. While the antidote is being prepared, I need you to seek the wounded and heal them. Yes, even the blue. The healing wings do not stand idle while others suffer. Dude, they really hate those blue dragonfly, eh? Really dislike them. Alright, so we have our AoE heal now. Which is fun. So if we just drop that, you know, just here. Be like, yo, what's up team? Nice. Nice. I mean, I can just manually heal them for the time being. That's a big old cooldown. What is it? I feel 30 seconds not too bad, I guess. Oh, you can just use, use the thing! Woohoo! Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is a cool ability. It heals, like, quite a lot. It would be interesting to see if it's an interaction uh, with her when you have blue skin. That would be interesting, actually, yeah. Probably not, though. It feels, like, a bit random. Alright, that's done. What else we got? We have to heal up the normal... the blue guys. They don't like the blue guys, but that's okay. We'll heal them anyway, because we're nice. We're a nice guy, you know? So if I don't target anyone, does it just do it on the floor? Yeah. That's good to know. Alright, let's go. I need a shorter cooldown on Saw. It's official. That's what I need. Yeah, two to three minutes. One and a half minute? How about instant? No cooldown. Let me Saw forever. Ooh, hover and a ring. Okay, the antidote is ready. Use it to search the supply crash for survivors. Work quickly, the effect will not last long. So you may have to reapply it. If any of my people yet draw breath, save them. 
They do not. I ask that you recover their horns uh, and their names may be honored. While inside, perhaps you can find evidence that the infestation came to be. Can we get hover. Nice. Running wild's cool, but flying? Yeah. Consume? Okay. That's pretty cool. I mean, it's not hard. Well, I'm saying, alright, that's famous last words right there. It's not hard. I like the effect that there's a big old dead trap. Oh, shit. No, 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 wait! <laughs> alright, alright, whatever. Look, 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 look. Don't even worry about it. It's not that hard. It went up really quickly, I didn't realize. Uh, hello? Are you okay? It went up way quicker than I was expecting. I guess I just gotta use it on cooldown, right? Gotta save him. Gotta save him. Excuse me, sir. That's really sad. You have to save, like, the... You have to, like, get the signet from the, the dead ones. That's really depressing. That's a really sad quest. Alright, that's done. Where's the rest of the team? You. Come hither. Yeah, they're dead, yeah. Where's the exit? Where's the exit? Nice, we get hover. And a ring. The healing wings of Oka. You have my gratitude in aiding us and my worm. Uh, in the most desperate hour, after we regain our strength, the healing wings will rendezvous the rest of our forces. Cinder tells me that uh, Ebethel lost everyone from her worm. I fear that no magic can heal such a wound. She may be stoic, but Ebethel feels this loss deeply. I'm te uh, Tell her I'm on my way. Does that mean... We're soaring, boys! Let's go. Uh, is it worm or worm? I mean, what's the, how do you pronounce that? What's the difference in pronunciation? I have no idea. I just assumed it was the same. I'm relieved that Viridia lives. If Dervishan is, says it's true, we will have her talents in battle to come. Deep breath. Dervishan's report is troubling. An enemy force called themselves the Primus have invaded Storm... Storm Sunder Crater, pinning the Ebon Scale down at the Siege Crash. These intruders are summoning violent elementals, recruiting vicious... Tarasek to their cause. Azurafel will need your help in, uh, by the crater. By wing or by talon, save our people. Once the scales are safe, also commander. Okay. Do you think, uh... Do you think we're gonna... F <laughs> do you think this, uh, this story is gonna culminate in finding out what happened with Deathwing? I got a sneaky suspicion we're gonna... F it's gonna be really, like, quite a funny revelation. Yeah, I think it's gonna be a, a good one. They'll be like, uh, what? Or maybe, like... I don't know, maybe you meet with the Horde or the Alliance or whatever, and they're like, uh, Nelfarian? <laughs> Whoops. Something, like, I, feel, I hope it's something like that, but... Surprise there isn't more voice acted? Oh, there will be. This is the second build of Alpha, man. There's gonna be a lot of voice acting stuff in this. This is a cool looking area, though, I gotta admit. It's up in the, uh, the top. I wonder if it's actually on the Dragon Isles, or this is a separate map ID. I'm gonna go with the latter. All right, we got some big boys, some big. Oh, look at this! It's a uh, a tauren. Who rock grim totem? Deep breath. It's a raid. Oh, is that a raid boss? Interesting. The pro dragons flying the reinforcements. An elemental army has been conjured at the site. Uh, Terrasec recruited their ranks. Our enemies are efficient and dangerous. The operation must be great purpose. Why the Primus seem so familiar? No time for that. Focus on the Drakthir trapped on the other side. Tangle with the, uh, the Terrasec. Now, Farian considered them a little bit, uh, more than fodder. Targets for our training. But they are cunning hunters and deadly when encountered in packs. Slay 20 conjured elementals and destroy three things. The conjured army. Uh, find clues about the Primus origins and the intentions. Let's go. So these are like, uh, kind of like Drakthir, but not really, right? 
they're bad drag beer. Oh! Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I like that one. That's a good one. This is gonna be so busy on launch day. Could you even imagine? On a pre-patch day? It's gonna be absurd. It's gonna be absolutely absurd. The elements awaken and fuse you with their strength. So he is, is he in the first raid, did you say? Yeah, I think he's, uh... I believe... Dungeon? Oh no, there he is. Nice. Holds the line, but the dragons have the ebon scale pinned down. Time for us to join the fight. Take point, give the signal uh, when we're in range of the dragon, then we'll hit with everything we have. Watch out for the ambushes, I have a bad feel. I have a bad feeling about this. I have a bad feeling about this too. Look at the size. Look at the size of that ham hawk. All right, there it is, level sixty. So we actually reached max level. So we can't actually go any higher than this physically on the beta, on the alpha right now. Oh. Oh, cutscene. The order is given. Attack. Oh, mass descent. Oh yeah, look at that. Ebon scale, strikers one. I love it. Look at him go. So Drakthu would be like 62 in pre-patch. Well, no, because you wouldn't be able to get any higher than 60 in pre-patch either. Oh. They are unworthy of dragon blood in their veins. Right. <laughs> We've unlocked Spires of Ascension, thank goodness. Alright, trinket. Report to Emberthal. Now that the fight is done, you ask me to report to Emberthal. Does Zuraleth Leth expect me to follow her commands? I think not. The Ember Scales answer to only <laughs> The Ember Scales only answer to the Earth Warder. And thus far have received no orders from Nelfarian. Still, I'm not blind to the threat that caused uh, these Prime Ministers represent. I'm certain they fought uh, their kind before, and yet, we will rally the grounds once more. Oh no, someone's got to tell them, man. Let's go. Dude, soaring is so satisfying. Why is this not in the game right now? Why is this not in the game right now? Do you think Drakthu will be playing on pre-patch? Uh, yeah. No, they're not actually on a new continent. They're, in a, they're on their own map ID. The pre-patch brings in the maps anyway. Like, it, it gives all the systems and the maps and everything like that. You just can't go to them. Scale, Commander, Emberthal. Oh, cutscene? These cultists speak of unleashing a storm. Is that Rathian? Oh no. Emberson. Are they from High Mountain? Were you sent by the Earth Warder? Where is Neltharian? Oh no. Oh no! It seems like there's much you do not know. I'm Emerson, and this is Rathian. We will answer all your questions in time. Oh no. We'll fight beside you, but we do not give orders here, dragons. Are they going to morph back? What 
it's heating up. I have been expecting you. Whoa. We meet again, champion. Is there something you wish to discuss? Learn from the past. Look to the future. Hell yeah. Preservation or devastation? Oh, it's time for talents. If what these dragons say is true, then a great battle is upon us. We need to focus, uh, we need to be focused on strong evoker. Time to choose your battle specialization. We you preserve your allies or devastate your enemies. To hone your combat skills to sharpen those, choose devastation. To maximize your healing potential, take the path of preservation. Either specialization will serve you well. Remember, you can change or adapt it later. Oh, look at that. That's cool. Oh, they upgraded to Epic with 208. Look there, across the reach. Prime Minister's forces are converging on the Froststone Vault. The storm they seek to unleash must be locked inside. We fought this enemy before, and we won. Now Farian commanded that the vault be secured, but I cannot remember why. There is no time for contemplation. Rally the Sarkareth and the Ebon Scales at the vault. Ensure the enemy does not breach it. Ah, oh, I can't even... S oh. What chapter are you on now? This is chapter 5. Oh, dude, what an aesthetically pleasing view. Yeah, look, this is so annoying, because look, the, the cooldown for Saw... Like, we could get over there really quickly with Saw, but we're just standing around waiting. It's time. Let's join our allies! I didn't go high enough. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Alright, a necklace. The prize inside. So the Prime Minister wants what's inside the vault. Let them come. Uh, we will show them what the Dracula are born to do. Are we healing them up? Is that the plan? Oh, okay, so that's kind of cool. So if you are preservation on this quest, you can actually heal them instead of attack them. Like, it, that's an option if you want to do that. Like, if you choose healing. So, obviously, you're not going to do a bunch of uh, damage, so. That's kind of fun. I like that. There we go. Defended. Don't even worry about it. OP heals? Yeah, someone healed me there. He was the NPC. We've overrun. They have breached the vault. What? We just defended them. Oh, cutscene. Wow, what a cutscene. That was a good one. Oh, lordy. <laughs> I'm assuming we're just gonna... Oh, there you go. What just happened? As Rathian flies towards the vault, he is too late. As uh, Kurog and his Primalist break the seal using the power harness from the Storm Sunder Crater earlier. The doors fling open with the wind and force as a storm emerges. Rastageth, the Storm Eater. Rastageth taunts Rathian with the, the death of his father, Nelfarian, before she drives him away violently, and the Storm Eater comes forth bringing the Tempest. Run. Retreat. <laughs> what happened to... What happened to, you know... Getting him. That's funny. I'm coming, Rathian. I'm coming. Speak your mind. The pain. Every action has consequences. I healed you up, son. It seems our fates are Many thanks, Alpha. intertwined. Your aid is unexpected. Ooh, shoulders. Nice. Thank you for healing me, Alpha. I hope that once we earn one another's trust, the Storm Eaters have not faced a dragon such raw elemental power. If there are others like her, wait. Where is Emberson? Did he survive? You must find black him. Black dragonfly. Oh, he's right there. You could have just looked to your left. <laughs> he wasn't very far away. <gasps> no, he's being dragged away! Wait, so they just drag him away and then... Just left him somewhere? Oh, he's literally just over here in this cave. I got you. I got you. I got you. Woohoo! That's a bit of an over overzealous rock. All right, let's go. Move on out. There's the team. I do love the Rathians involved. I think that's fun. Final orders. The storm unleashed by uh, Rastageth. It's too powerful. We must evacuate 
Uh, the only home we've ever known. There's no longer an Earth Warden to command us. For the first time, we are free to make our own choices, to find our own fate. Wherever you go in this new age, I hope you find worthy allies. Tell them our story. As for me, I will stay here and look for survivors. Along the way, I may have found answers about our past. May fortune favor us all, Alpha. Organize the evacuation. All right, we're off. Reach the own the old Wern grounds. All right, everyone packed up, ready to go. Oh, hello, Nostormu! Yo, what a legend! Everyone's uh, oh. Oh, there's going to be a big old dragon fight. <laughs> ah, Nostormu, I'm pleased to know all the draft specs admit their bitter end. Tell your queen I'm coming for her. The storm reckons comes for your comes for, uh, comes for us all. The release of uh, resting of heralds are great dangers as well. Just as you awaken heralds, great change. Oh, you're awakening heralds, great change. The kingdoms of Azeroth must be warned. Go to them. Along the way, you may discover a new destiny on your, of your own. This is it. This is how we end up on Azeroth. I love his little, like, sparkly sand stuff. It was our destiny to be the finest soldier of his dragon kind. We pledge our lives to fight an affair inside. Our lives, Evoker. And what was our vow worth to the Aspects? Nothing. They locked us away like a broken playthings. We are not broken. I don't think they're that happy about coming, uh, coming to hang out with everybody else, to be honest. I know what the aspects asks of us, but the healing wings cannot join you. We have the uh, we still have wounded, and these wingless um, draconids have grown attached to us. Not my worm, and uh, not my flying anywhere. I plan plan for us to cross the channel to the Dragon Isles. Plenty of us other need aid, I suspect. Thank you for helping my people. Oh, no one wants to go. Rathian speaks of a group called the Alliance. Noble folk who care for one another and defend this world. He has offered to introduce us to their leaders in a place called Stormwind. Come with us. I agree. What? Empowered by the magic of Nord Stormwind. No Stormy, our heroes take to the skies and fly to Storm in Ogrima to warn the Alliance and Horde at the beginning uh, and begin to join those cultures. Was that some credits? You beat the game. We're at the gates. Speak your mind. Ordinarily, such uh, a flight would take considerably longer. When the bronze aspect himself speeds you on your way, you allow you to come the journey in record time. The soldiers here with the pointy weapons. Not to worry, merely a formality. <laughs> I shall see about arranging an audience with Lord Commander uh, while you and uh, Orothel get their bearings. Thankfully, I will considerably influence in the city. Gain entrance Never to Stormwind. Let your guard down. Perhaps Rathia's influence isn't as considerable as he thinks, if this is the welcome he receives. I love it. Perhaps we should get an idea of the city. This is, of course, our new home. A scouting mission, if you will. Go and see what this place has to offer. Try not to upset the locals any more than you must. Although, I doubt many of them are used to seeing dragons walking among them. Uh, meet up with us once you've gotten a lay of the land. Alright, off we go. Bye, guys. Oh, it's sure. Rathian, you are warned against making unannounced visits, especially when you bring company. A thousand pardons, dear Spymaster, but I come bearing the Titans of the Dragon Aspects for Lord Commander Turalyon. As for the Drakthir, uh, you have my word they will cause no harm and they have come seeking refuge, not conflict. Their conduct will be on your head, Rathi, and the Drakthir will leave have the... Oh. The Drakthir have my leave to roam the city. But know this, SI7 will be watching. I love when you get flying mounts. Um... Oh, I love that. So people like... I don't trust dragons, not since that lady pressed, pressed a business. <laughs> That's so cool. So do I have, did they give me mount training? No, that's not very nice. I'm not afraid of you, dragon. This is just like the DK Walker's chain, yeah. I love that they like, they're, they're like cut up about Lady Presta. I think that's actually amazing. Do do a bow roll. What? <laughs> <laughs> mm. 
This is Lion's Charity. No horde allowed. What? Do you plan to eat us? Do you know Alexstrasza? Wait, what are you? Oh, I love this. That is amazing that they're all like well angry. Why did they think they were horde? I bid 20 gold, not 15. But I was going to buy that. Oh, the dragon guy said a dragon loves a good horde. The banker mistook that as horde. Oh, okay. Yeah, they can speak draconic, yeah. Alright, so we've got to go to the embassy and the portal room. They should definitely give you some sort of speed thing, though. This is like a proper... Proper mission. In time, all answers become... It seems we are not the only recent arrivals here. Oh, I love that. We made it. Do you chase your own tail? My dog does that all the time. <laughs> so good. These portals reek of blue dragonfly magic. <laughs> Why haven't I seen your people before? <laughs> oh, that's so good. <laughs> that's so good. Oh, I love it. All right. Here's the team. The Alliance granted an asylum here in Stormwind. Sounds like a quite an interesting place. I have been expecting you. A spectral invitation. Ah, Alpha, I trust your tour to say you went well. No one threw any through you, did they? I'm told that happens sometimes. That is... King Hilarious. <laughs> At any rate, I finished meeting with Lord Commander Trallian and his allies, and they accepted the Aspect's invitation to the Dragon Isles. Preparations are underway for the journey to our, your homeland. Ah, but where are my manners? We should have a chat with the others. Speak with Rathian to learn of the Council's meeting. Until next I'm assuming time. that's a cutscene. The black Is there something you wish to discuss? So much for the Dragon Isles beyond the Forbidden Reach. I cannot wait for you to see it. Now then, I believe that a uh, diminutive archaeologist Said something about putting together an expedition. Azeroth faces many threats. Ooh! A tabard! You turned every head in storm when we arrival, Alpha. No doubt, some citizens were more amenable to your presence than others. In order to better commune with the other races, we dragons adopt a mortal visage, like ones you've seen before. Not only does this put the allies at ease, but it also makes passing through doorways considerably less destructive. <laughs> Clearly, the essence of the dragon kind flows through the drag there. I suspect you and many of your abilities uh, suggest a visage. Walk with me. Every action has consequences. Ask about choosing a visage? A visage is an expression of how you want to be seen by others. Will you be friendly and approachable, or stern and intimidating? Certain of my kin choose the latter. As for myself, I settle on a dashing, perilous. Per on dashing and perilously, perilously handsome. The magic within you, Alpha. Look inside and focus on a form that reflects how you want to s the world to see you. There it is. Choose identity. Activate to automatically assume your visage when leaving combat and soaring. Oh, I didn't know that. That was a new ability, right? Do you trust me? I must say, I really am ex an excellent teacher. If you ask me, you made a fine choice, Alpha. Your visage suits you well. Now back to the task at hand. We have an expedition to prepare for. Learn from the past. Look to the future. There it is. That's the end. That's the end of the starting zone. Why is it... Oh, is it an alliance version? Is there a red one? Sounds like they're adding more races to the Visage. It does kind of sound like that, doesn't it? But I, I, I wouldn't bet it. I really enjoyed that. I thought that was actually really great. Yeah, I thoroughly enjoyed that. I thought that was a, a really good time.